Welcome to the support videos for Control M. This video will show you how to apply the option the user must change password at the next login. From the Control M configuration manager, go to security authorizations tab. Select the user which you want to apply the option, in this case BMC01 and edit its properties mark the option user must change password at next login and confirm the change by clicking OK. Now after applying the change for the user BMC underscore one we will try and log in to the workload automation client and see if you asked to change the password. As you can see, we were able to connect to the client without having been requested for a password change. And this is because there are a couple of system parameters uh, related to the Control M Enterprise Manager that uh, we needed to change for this um, to take place. So to do that, go to the Home tab and uh, select the Control M EM and then click on system parameters advanced and then look for password expiration on off parameter and change its value to when and then do the same with the parameter user user change password and verify that its value is also set to when Once you do this, you will need to recycle the GUI server from the Control M Configuration Manager. The GUI server has been uh, recycled. So then go to the Control M Configuration Manager uh, security tab authorizations to verify the user BMC underscore one keeps to uh, continues to keep the option user must change password at the next login checked and uh, from the workload automation client we try to log in with the user BMC underscore one after a few seconds we see that um, the user is requested to change uh, the password After entering the new password, we will be logged in with the workload automation. Uh, we will be logged into the workload automation client with the user BMC underscore one with the password changed. With the password changed, if from the control configuration manager we reopen the properties of the user BMC underscore one, we will see that the option user must change password at the next login isn't checked from the previous change. And with this, we conclude the video. Please check our database and YouTube channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching.